My name is Steve Kelly. I'm Director of Corporate Partnerships for Fenway Sports Management. We're here at the MGM Music Hall at Fenway, positioned right behind Fenway Park. Uh, and our organization sits below Fenway Sports Group, which is the ownership group that owns not only the Red Sox, but Roush Fenway Racing, Liverpool Football Club, and now the Pittsburgh Penguins. And, and most recently, as part of our real estate efforts, operate a state-of-the-art music facility here, uh, right in the heartbeat of Boston, uh, in the Fenway neighborhood. My name is Randy George, and I'm the Vice President of Technology Operations for the Boston Red Sox. I've been with the club for 21 years, uh, and I, I've been blessed to uh, see a ton of things and experience a ton of things you know, during my tenure here, especially from a technology point of view. You know, I've been responsible for you know, all of our systems and wireless communications and wired integrations. I'm responsible for information security. The MJF Music Hall is a 5,000 seat concert venue. Uh, we just opened last September, uh, and it's a, it really is a world-class, modern, concert venue. Wireless and wire communications, you know, is really central to almost everything we do. We sort of have our hands full right now with, you know, almost 10,000 devices connected to the network, 5,000 ports of extreme, you know, wired data that's running to different various parts of the ballpark, 600 access points uh, by way of our recent Wi-Fi upgrade, another 100 here in the MGM Music Hall. The reality is, is end users, fans, they all want it very quickly. They all want what they want and they want it now. We've learned that. Um, and thankfully, Extreme Networks has helped us have a response for that, whether that's through digital ticketing or seeing menus within our premium spaces on their phones, um, or just uploading a picture or a story to their social feeds in the moment that it's happening. As the wireless network evolves, you know, and as we start to sort of construct all these different sort of properties uh, around the perimeter of the ballpark, you know, we hope to kind of extend the footprint of the wireless environment and hopefully unlock the ability to provision and deploy new services, you know, things like location services, facial recognition technology to help sort of fans get in the park a little bit faster than they can today. You know, this, the, this new deployment is sort of unlock, unlocking our ability to sort of pursue those different use cases. In the future, uh, you know, our, our mentality, I think what's made our partnership so special is when we grow, we look to grow with our partners. When we knew we were building this new venue, our first thought was we need to call Extreme. So it's an exciting opportunity to take everything we built in partnership with Extreme and extend it out into the broader Fenway neighborhood. And I couldn't be happier with the relationship. I mean, you know, Extreme has been incredible to us. You know, the, the technology stack has been very reliable and high performing. You know, we plan to extend that deployment for quite a ways going forward.